Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Mori Survival Season 2! Ooh yeah! Also do this. <laughs> Just so I get better professional card, that's why I changed my settings down a bit. But anyway, welcome back guys. Once again. Uh yeah. Before we actually get into the episode, I'm gonna uh, uh, and then a quick warning to you. Um about what I done last episode. I know I created all just sleeps and he jumps on me. I know I created the, I created the Titan last episode. Uh, which is fun and all and it's good it's good messing around for travelling it's really fast. However, don't log out if you're in a server. I don't know if you're a single player but probably does. If you're in a multiplayer server do not log out while still sitting inside this. When you log back in you fall straight through the ground. It's like a lag thing, you fall straight through the ground and then you die. Like, I, I happened to me ask all my stuff, that's why you can probably tell that my durability of my diamond tools is a little bit maybe higher than the very last episode. Because I had to try and I t I take the my player file from a previous save and put it in the server so I could get my, uh, these tools back. So, yeah, I've also not got a helmet as well. But, yeah, so just big warning to you guys. I didn't lose the, the titan, of course, because I didn't get destroyed, I just I fell straight through and lost basically everything but I'll did lose everything because my grace one was like minus 236 I died at that's it that's the distance where you know here if you're in creative mode you still die as well so yeah that's how warranty guys do not log off while inside the titan anyway enough of the boring health and safety warnings in today's episode so I should probably tell about the title this is me compressing my storage down and you also probably tell me move, move my bed down there because I've got an idea what I'm going to use this area for later on but anyway so yes, I've got all this storage here, but I kind of get running low because I've got no chest for blocks and that, and it's a bit cramped. But if I come down to my basement where all my power stuff is, I've cleared this huge area. That's what I pick. I've done without my hammer because Cameron's actually borrowed my hammer now. He's not online, so I can get it back. But I put all these chests down, right? And what I'm gonna do with these chests is using Project Red transportation. I'm going to link these all up to a system so I can access them all from one from just one place and they just won't be in the way so everything will be stored down here all lovely tucked away and good to go. So yeah, that's what this, that's what this area here is for, probably just chests and stuff. And I'm going to have like a, a request pipe here which is sort of like in Mamer Season 1 I had the uh, uh, the Planet Energistics ME store system. It's sort of like that, but a little bit more like. So it's sort of not as like OP as that, how you can create everything in one little block. You actually have to have the space for all the chests here. Which is a lot better. So yeah, let's get right into it. First things first, I'm going to have to create item transport pipes. These are basically just the default pipes. As you can see, I've got them here. Just the default pipes made. Uh, but uh, it's default pipes from Project Red Transportation. I don't really know how much I actually need, so I'll just get a couple, quite a few. So I can take them off the list. Next thing I need is junction pipes. These are these ones here. They're a little bit expensive, but oh wait, yeah, so this, this, this is what these things are for. This is what I made to show you. Um, well, I've got them down here. Yeah, I've had these silicon boils. I can't really say it since for ages. So you've probably seen them. So. I need them for the infused silicon, which is just it's an compound, which is just these surrounded by redstone. So let me just wait. No, no, wait. I need to get my my saw as well. Don't I? Where's my saw? There it is. So to do this, I need actually I'll do it in this one. To do this, I need silicon boils, uh, red silicon compound, and silicon is made by doing that. So if I go like this and go with that. And that I can make quite a couple of these. That should do. And then that, that, and then wait, what? Let me try it again. I don't know why it's doing that. Okay, let me just make quite a lot of these then. There we go. Make ten. I think should be enough. There we go. That should be enough, I think. Oh, wait, not enough, actually. Right, yeah, I think I should do me good, but anyway, I'll put these in the smellery, and I'll be right back once I've, they've finished cooking up. Right, now that they've all cooked up, we've got our infused silicon. What we can do now is if I come over to here, I can create these. Oh, wait, actually, I need to create the luminar. So that's why I need to create this luminar, which is just that. 
four of that, um, six of that, and how much could I make? 32. That's be more than enough. Now I can make these. I want to make. I want to quite a lot of these ones. So I want to make. I'll make. Ten now. Just for. Just so I don't overwhelm. Just so I don't. Just so I've got a decent amount, but not. Don't want to use it all up just for no reason. Um. So yes, because I'll probably do most of like kind of the. They look pretty that off camera, which I'll probably just show you how it works. And anyway, uh, I can also what I can actually do is I can actually set it up so I can put like, ores inside the quest, the uh, ores inside the system, and it'll automatically put into pulverizer and reservoir furnace and that, and put it straight back into the big chest room or so uh, down here, right there, which will be good. And then what else are we wanting? Oh wait. Junction pipes and an interface pipes. What these interface pipes does actually, these proper ones, what it allows me to do is it allows me to um plug images. Um, basically if I put it in, if I put oh excuse me, if I put that uh, in that thingy chest that that, uh, that inventory I put next to like an inventory like a chest or something it will pick it up as actually I want to make a little more of these. It will allow me to gain access to it basically. Allow the pipes to gain access to it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put uh, hmm. Let me think. Let me think. Let me think. So I want to try and maybe make almost kind of sorting system kind of stuff down here. Hmm. What I might do actually is I might destroy this and then just put all it in there and a. Uh, Clive will help putting all the stuff in, there we go. And so this will be the chest I put stuff into. This chest here, and then I'll have... Wait, that won't work though, because that's there. No, it will work. I just need to know how to place it. I won't have to probably use a... Uh, why won't let me fit through? Oh, because I'm selling a chest, eh? There we go, I'm going to have to... Oh. Uh, Probably keep the system so it goes underneath. So if I break that, I think I have an interface pipe. I should just put that up there. The good thing I've got Clive on me, so you can just pick up anything and drop them despawn. Clive, oh, Clive, oh, for goodness sake, Clive, come over here. Where are you, Clive? What are you doing? What are you playing at? There we go. And I just put that in there. Keep these on me. Just chuck, chuck a couple of stuff in here. Yes, yeah, so I'll be okay to now. So what I can do now is if I come up here, and so this is connected in there. So that all connect into an interface pipe here. That should connect to that. And if I just get my item transport pipes, and then just, oh, uh, put one there. Oh no. Like that, there we go. Just carry them along here. Because it's all like the old, I used to, I used to know the old red power pipes from like Tekka days, because when I used to play Tekka before they brought Feed the Beast and that, I used to know them, but this is like sort of the new ones from it. So they're a little bit better. Clive, you're causing a scene here. Right, how am I going to do this? Hmm. Uh, yeah, I'll just do this, right. For the first ones, I can just place it like that, and then you have an interface pipe on every single one of these. That shows are connected. So, uh, yeah, yeah, sorry, yeah. So now these are connected, so I'm going to probably do the same, but for, like, these ones and that, so. The only thing is I don't like when I put the only thing I'm quite worried about is if I put them like that. It, I don't know if it'll connect us or not, that's the only thing. Let me just see, it probably will. Cause if that works then then uh, if that works then I might not even need to 
put ones there, that will just save me a lot. So, I c oh, oh, excuse me guys, got a message. Um, I said from Ross. Um, uh, so like that. There we go. And this is all connected now. Yeah, so I'll put that like that in now, and then I'll see if this works. So next thing to make in the checklist is the quest pipe, which is what I actually did. Is it, that's basically the interface that I like, that's sort of the computer that was in the uh, the terminal that was in the ME. So basically, one of these is this one, and it's easy enough made. Just only one of these. Uh, so we can take this off. Quest pipe. And what I can do is if I can, I can put, wait, if I just oh, turn back into a bat, if I put these at this and then put the crest pipe there, no I don't want to actually connect into that, that's the only problem, hmm, I could probably have it there then, that's the only thing, wait, 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 wait. this will probably work with panels won't it, let me just see. See if I put a thing like that, let's just still open the chest and will it connect? No it won't connect so that's the thing that's what I want basically. Lovely. So if I do this, then I can have the panel like that. Oh. Oh uh, let me just get a, that. Oh. Oh another one that. What do I do? So you know that, so it doesn't have anything right now, so you can I don't know what that is, but anyway, so yeah, so if I wire this, okay, pipe this, let's kick this up to the pipe system. Oh. Eh, eh. Oh. Down, down, oh. Not if it did very well here, am I? There we go. I don't want it to connect to this bit because. There we go, like that. Yeah, I'll just break this. See that little green, like, kind of sparkle thing? Shows that it. Can it's work all uh, kind of connected together? So um, uh, so let's next need to make some null logic chips, which are these things here, which requires some paper, which I don't actually have on me right now. But I've got some in here. I've got four paper. I don't need more than that. So let me just quickly grab some, just like that. So that's yeah. Because if I have this now, it'll make everything a lot easier. For me, a lot less can be running, running, uh, running through chests. I can just uh, search them. I want to actually see if they actually will connect to these because they keep get these deep storage units. Then that will be even better. So let me just go over here and create these no logic things. I only probably quite a lot of them. Yeah, all of them will do. And then f I only the item responders things. Wait, I need more redstone on me. Wait, am I a redstone? Oh golly gosh. Match the redstone. Let me just nip down here quickly. Wait, there are any blocks on me? Uh, oh, that'll do. Oh, let me just grab this redstone quickly. It's a good thing, is the fact that there's so many ores. I'm probably going to like a full-on mining mission with my hammer when I get it back next time. So I'll be all full of resources. There we go. Yeah, because the good thing is, I don't think I ever need any more redstone coming I used to have, but I've actually used tons. Of Same with the iron. I thought I'd never need iron again, but I used so much iron in that. Um, let me just put Clive down. There we go. There we go. Uh, so yeah, because there's so much iron in that making that mech that I don't get quite a lot more. But the good thing is the fact that the tag B team has got so such good ore spawns, so that's fine. Anyway, right. What was I making? Yes, I was over here making one of these. Oh, I do actually have orange lumar. Where is it? There is. And one of these. Make some of that. Oh, wow. I want a lot of more orange dye. It's the only thing. Hmm. Yeah, it's going to be a problem. Let me see if I can make some. I'll make some of the magenta. I wonder if you've got a lot of this. So we need these item broadcasters. Why won't that make them? I don't have any gold, that's why. Let me just 
yeah, we need a lot more dye, so if we'll go out and find some more dye then. Um and there it is. Lovely. So I'll show us for the first one and I'll go out and get some more dyes and stuff and link it all up for so next time I come back it'll all be good to go. So we'll link it with this one. But get an empty hand and click on it, I can put a uh, item responder chip there. Oh we have to right click with that actually. that oh yeah this is what you need to right click here so item filter filter mode items are white listed items are black listed uh, I don't know what that means uh, I don't really know anyway what's this priority I'll put this minus two so this is the default route basically so if then Shift click it in there, so you see it's in there now, and then same with this hide mode, hide I'm hiding, hide nothing, and distraction. Wait, no, I don't know. There you go. Nope, nope, I'm busy. Uh, so this should work like that. So yeah, these two kit to there, and uh, I think this should work. If I put some wrestler in here, head on up here, right click here. Yes. So now we can wait. So we can go. Let's say I want twenty. Oh, oh no, I search. That's a search bar. Yeah. So I want a couple. Uh, right, submit. So wait here. Should take a little while, but it should come up eventually. Oh, maybe I'll come out. I may won't come out because I'm not the extraction mod. Yeah. So right, yeah. I need to make some extractor modules. Wait. I'll actually put them on the list. So I'll go and make one of them. So let me know those ones are working. So let me just get my extractor modules. There we go. One of these. Oh, cyan. Last oh, I've got some of them. Oh no, I made it into green Omar. Right. I'll be right back guys when I've got all the dyes I need. I thought I might kind of miss count read because I only thought yeah I only counted four so yeah I'm going to need a lot more so I'll be back in a little bit guys. See you in a minute. Right. Welcome back guys and girls. We're back in the March 5 of season 2 uh, world and as you can see like I've went, out of camera I went and got tons of dyes. Like, I mean literally tons. I got all them. I went around for ages trying to find them. Uh, yes, you also see I put the request pipe here and I surrounded it with gold blocks so it wouldn't catch anything, make it look kind of fancy. And anyway, with these things, and now we can. Oh, at mod dot project. I really like how you can do that and just see all the mod items. It's pretty handy. Anyway, right. What do we need to make? Do I have anything else we need to make? Yeah, I think I already to. Yeah. I need to make extractor. Thing. So where's extractor ones? Where are they? This one? Nope. I think it's the blue one. Knit the blue one. So this requires cyan, which is got some cyan. And let's make. Wait, how much does it require per extractor? It requires four. Let's get. I'm gonna need one. One extractor. Um, so you can see I also like put all the pipes into this. So I need one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. I need sixteen extractors. So sixteen times four. I need a stack of this Alumar basically. Which I can't do. Sugar. I'll make as much as I can now then. And how much how do we need again? Yeah, I need more gold nuggets. Uh, yeah, I need more gold nuggets, and I need more redstone. Do I need redstone? Oh, I've got. I don't know where I put my redstone. It's down in here. If I remember correctly, this one, this one, this one. There it is. 
and back upstairs there we go and head over here right so what we need to do is turn this back into gold uh, and turn these back into nuggets and then I can make these I said let me make these extractor ones make 12 that'll do them now and I won't <coughs> hold on to these now actually until we actually need them so I make extractor ones and I also need more of these item broadcasters so I should be able to go Wait, what am I missing? Oh, I'm missing this, so I need to... There we go. Uh, iron Broadcasters. What am I missing? Oh, I need to make more of these, so I don't actually need more, so I need more paper. Where's all my... What all this? I don't know where all my paper is. I might not have any. That's might be the thing. I've got plenty now, though. I'm going to just turn it all into these, and... I can make 10 of them, that's fine, and uh, these ones, which I need more Lumar for, and I can always make tons of lamps if I need be. There we go. I'm going to need, what am I missing to make these, because I've got everyone here. Oh, it's the no logic things, yeah, so I'm going to head on downstairs. So you put extractor molecule, extractor molecule, extractor chip on this one. So let me just sort of right click, uh, filter. Wait. Uh, items are blacklisted, that means anything can pass through. What's this one? Extraction is not stimulated, okay. I'm just sorry. right click on there. And I should start making things. Yep, well, that'll be things that you. Yeah. That's the only thing, though. Oh, so it'll always go that way. Oh, no, wait. Yeah, I put a default route to that. It'll go pretty slowly, that's why I need to do the upgrades. Yeah, I'll just go that way, I realise I can't go there. It'll go into whatever chest it wants. Why does it do that? I thought it would just go straight to the default route. Where's it going? I always just click on float right. Yeah, I keep on going. I don't know how it just go, does it go straight to this one. Hmm, I don't know. It's like logistics pipes where it just goes straight wherever it needs to be go. Right, this has got broadcasters. I need to put extractor chip. Uh, extractor chip. Wait, no, I need to. Wait a minute, so let me just sort of. Um, right click with this. Items are blacklisted, so oh, they'll all be saved the same, right? So you can just go right click, right click, right click. See, if these all have them? Nope. Nope. Let me just pick up my luggage, don't you dare. Um, filter. No filter. Default. Priority. I'll switch minus two. Let's put that low, okay. Right, does this one have them? Nope. This one have it? Yes, this one has it. Oh, it's got two extractor chips though, so we don't want that. It's got an extractor, yep, that's got an extractor, yeah. And then let's just responder chip, blacklist, uh, okay, let's just do that. Wait a minute. Let me just get these back out because I think I've done something wrong with these. Uh, if I remember, let me just pick them all up. Um, on blacklist. Priority. I put these to zero. Oh, put these to zero. Because that's where they should be. No stack. Nope. So what's wrong with this one? Blacklist. I don't know. I think everything seems fine with that. So put one there. There, there, and then one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two. So that all means these are all getting picked up by the. So I don't know how it goes. Like it goes through like everywhere before it eventually just decides it wants to go somewhere. Even though I've put this to be the default route, but I don't know why it's not. 
It just means it'll go there no matter what. I should maybe make it, I don't know, I'm just going to leave it there because it will eventually start stocking up anyway. Take its time but it will do it eventually. Uh, so this is everything, doesn't it? Oh, it doesn't have the orange ones in it. One, two. Oh, no. I'll move that one. It's got three, it's got three, it's got three. This only has a one, so. One, two, three. One, two, three. Then one, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, one. Yeah, so I don't know what's wrong with these, why I'm not going inside them. They're just going anywhere. Like, maybe, wait, what's this on? Minus two. This one's on. Minus two. This one's on. Minus two. So why are they not just going inside the chests? I don't know why they go everywhere first, then they actually can't go in there. Um, this is maze two as well. Yeah, it does. I don't. I don't understand that. I'm fine with it because it's going in the same place. Don't get me wrong, but I don't know why it's taking so damn long to do it. Anyway, so uh, now we need to make our. Now we need you know, all the chips, now we need to make a router. Let's call again a router utility. Which we can see here. One of these ones which cards, one emerald, five iron and redstone. So <gasps> no I've got hiccups. So one of them and next we need chip upgrades. That's these things. Which you can get access to if I right click right and then I can put oh, wait. All I really want to do is put these on the extractor molecule the extractor ones basically. So see if I right click on this, pull out the extractor one. And then right click, plug him in there, I can install install different things. So the left one is like how uh delays between the extraction, so like if I do it to like, like you can do it to one delay so I'm just like what oh, instantly takes them out. And this one's how much it takes at a time, which I'd rather take this one than anything. But I'm gonna go and take all the extractor molecules out and see if I can upgrade them. Because the extractor ones are the only ones I really want out. They yeah, have anything in them. It's a glass. The extractor molecules that are bugging them out. It's the only thing I want them to kind of stack together. But they're not going to, I don't know why. Um, extractor molecules. I keep calling them molecules. I don't know why. Extract. There's chips. I meant to say. Oh, there's an. There's a Enderman. There's a. Oh, nope. Zombie pigman. In the house. So if I head on upstairs now. With my extractor molecules. Hey, chips. There we go. Uh, I can craft some of these ones. So I want to get the, the LX upgrade. These are easy to make but first I want to make these. So I'm running a lot of on paper so yeah I'll run to the episode waypoint so uh, rep, uh, uh, we're coming up to the episode's round off point so um, we'll just, I'll just round it off round up here now. So yeah next episode we've uh, Match this, so this should work. So I'm going to put the extractor molecules back. Extractor mo Why are you calling them? Right, in two minutes. I'm just going to put this back in here. So I can show it working. So if I go in here, this will show me everything how it works. So if I say I want 3 request 3, all, and they should come. Hopefully. I don't know why they're not coming. Okay, so they're not. Wait, are they? For some reason they're not coming, I don't know why. Hmm. 
This is rather confusing. They're there. I think I'm just going to extract their ship. Is it extracting? Wait. Filter mode items are blacklisted, items are whitelisted. Matching. Wait, I don't know what this AS does. Why is it not working? Uh, let's do that, maybe, see if that helps. And now it should work. So if we do all and then submit. Oh, there we go, yeah, successfully requested. Wait for them. Uh, why is that coming? Why is it taking so long? Let's see if it's done this thing where it's went on like, every single pipe before it gets to Ming. Oh, why is it dropped down there? Oh, that's not going to be a problem. So yeah, look into fix that. By the way, guys, thanks for watching. And I'll probably fix this all off, off camera and show you it working smooth as anything next time. So see you next time, guys. Adios.